my name mm. on chat. Oh, I see. Your character got ready uh, for this game. Um, I'm working on maps and Chili's finishing up her character, so you got a couple minutes if you'd like. No rush. I think I think I'm I think I got it all, so Okay, well I'm working right. on maps, oh. so take your time. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go find me some magic items. You didn't choose that yet? I'm ahead of the game, holy cow. Yeah, I've been closing for like days. And I wanna die. We lad sign up. Yeah, the we lad sign up. <laughs> That's good. I have an interview fight. tomorrow morning. A job at a veterinary clinic down the road for me opened up so I put in my resume and they actually called me this morning. <laughs> I was like <gasps> I put the Yeah. So even though it might start I might start part time and depending on what they want hours wise I might just balance it between the two, my full time job and the part time job. Oh my because it, it says in between it says might eventually become a full time position and since we've heard really good things about them, I mean that's where we took our cat to get fixed. They did a really nice job with him. Um, they might even offer me more than what my full-time job is, and then I can just be like, yeet, bye, fuckers. <laughs> you, know? you know, I've got my dream job over here. Oh, but, I would, mm-hmm. but I would feel really bad because I do, like, 99% of the people at this new store. It's a new clean store. Like, I, it can be really, really successful, and it's, you know, it's been paying my bills, so... <laughs> But, but I tried applying for a similar job like this in Lafayette, and it just didn't happen because it's Lafayette, and with the veterinary school right there made it very difficult. So the fact that this opened up, it's like awesome. Well, and so we're just gonna see how it goes tomorrow. So, ooh, changes. Most difficult seals. So, um, mm-hmm. you said, uh, common, either t- two, com- two, no, two, either two common or one uncommon. Interesting. Oh, yes, Jiffy, I saw the spell slot thing, and then I found a better uncommon item that I chose instead, so. Yeah, because I was looking at all the common items, I was like, eh. And then I chose one that I could, that would benefit me, I think, more term, more long term, so. But of cats. So. Just so you're aware, you can wild shape into anything with a half challenge rating. It doesn't have to be a war horse or a panther if you're aware of this, right? Um, actually... Okay, well, because it's sec- it says second level, the max limitation was one-fourth, and then at fourth level, right. the max was one-half. Right. So because, I- because I'm fifth, it- they both can be... One half now? Well, well, they're both one half anyways, right? No, the panther is only one fourth. Oh, okay. Well, it can go up to one half. But I'm, I'm saying that you can, any any creature that you've seen, as long as it's one half, you can be. You're not limited to a panther or a war horse. It could be a reef shark or whatever. I thought... Uh... A rat. A poisonous snake. A means unearthed arcana, right? Correct. Yeah, I see why people hate this shit. <laughs> you could be a black bear or a boar, a constrictor snake, a crocodile. You could be anything that's challenge one half or lower. You don't have to. You don't have to pick two. You can only shape twice. Right. Okay. Right. As long as you know. Okay. Okay. Well, I know that now, but I like those two. Okay. I mean, obviously, if the situation arises, I can Google it real quick and just be like, eh, hey, <laughs> hey, I'm, yeah, I'm... oh, look, a lake. <laughs> Guess what? <laughs> I'm gonna become a shark or something. Okay. 
But it, but you're not gonna limit to an animal that I've seen previously. You're not gonna throw that stipulation on me. Well, I am. Okay. But you're a druid, you. so you've probably seen plenty. True. Yeah. True. Circle of the Moon gets really crazy animals. That's like, holy cow. All coins in it. Well, that thing I didn't. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Um, what did I choose this one? Oh. Oh, there. Spend one spell slot to regain one of the points. Spend one spell slot to regain. How did I find that before? Oh. Never mind. <laughs> Oh, they, oh, yeah, you go to the max CR column. Awesome. Did you say we could have up to uncommon? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Just check in. About check away. Yo. So if something were like to hmm, what are we doing? Oh, the tags too. Okay, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. How many so, times can I cast cant trips? However much you want. Oh, okay. There's no limit on those. Okay. But the spell slots, you only have. I only have. One, two, three. Oh yeah, that's right. Monday we had session zero. That's fine. Yeah, yeah. This is why people hate Unearth Arcana. I understand now. <laughs> makes so uh, much sense. I can only use this number of spell slots. Oh, uh, this, per... this item is perfect. <laughs> Oh, Chili, out of curiosity, what is your magic item? Uh, or magic items? Cloak of protection. Uncommon? Yes. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, because it because it gives me plus one AC and plus one to all my saving throws. It's like a luck stone, but better. Well, I, well, I got rid of the sword. I got rid of my wooden shield for a different item. Because of a of a spell that I can cast, and so, uh, yeah, a little bit. So mm -hmm. figured I needed a free hand anyway. Fair enough. So no, I'm okay. just trying to I'm trying to compare to see like if I'm breaking anything or if I'm being reasonable, and I think I'm being reasonable. Okay, great. I'm sending it to you now, Shri. Uh, it fits really well. It does. does. It wisdom modifier it does. plus your druid level, so... My wisdom modifier is 4 plus 5, so I have 9. I can cast 9 spells per long rest. Okay. Um. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, that makes more sense. Okay. Are you sure you sent it to me? Because I don't have anything. Um, Did just... You email it? Me? Did you Not... send it by snail mail? Uh, What's going on? Love it. Okay, Sina, did you take any healing? Do I know what your character is, by the way? I forgot what it was. Uh, I am a monk. So you don't? Do you have healing or no? I have a form of like trance. <laughs> I do not have any like healing. I, I I do have cure wounds. Is what I'm saying. Well, that's that's great. That's good. Because I don't know what stuff he's gonna throw at us. I, I was, also have. I was kind of like really, really, really hoping cure like. Crossing my fingers that you would actually take a healing spell, but good, good. 
I like I, it. I got that, but I've also got some really OP um, weather things, and one spell actually allows me to ch channel my inner Yasuo, so <laughs> kind of OP, especially my third level spells. Oh, I'm gonna nerf so. that. You gonna nerf all three actually? Are you gonna nerf me? <laughs> me, I don't want to be nerfed. Well, let's we'll see. I got a wind wall, and then I've also got. Can you imagine if, like, when when the developers of League are like nerfing the game, they just have like mini mini champions going, "Please, please don't nerf me, please." Out of curiosity. <laughs> and so um, they don't. Drifty. Yeah. Yeah. yeah they, sure. they create so champions of, like Yone. Yeah. Some yeah. of my spells have a thing where it says, um, "When cast at higher level." Mm -hmm. Can you kind of no. find? How does that um, not? How does that not make sense? So like, Are if you... it's a, it's a so if it's a level one spell, let's say for example, mm -hmm. and I cast it as a level three, mm -hmm. is that when it? Is that when the additional effects take? Why yes, it is. Well, I wasn't sure if it was based on. Uh -huh. My personal level, or if it was based on the on the ability level, I guess you could say. No, not Oakley. Why? Why? <laughs> it's so cliched. No. <laughs> My baby cousin's named Oakley. Okay, but he's not uh, a furball druid. So I hesitated. I, I hesitated so hard on the magic item. So hard, but no, 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 no. This is this is so much better. Y'all should have met my tiefling through it. It was fun. I gotta make him have a cameo at some point. You should totally make him show up in this campaign. Oh, why at all, man? Be great. Oh my god. Right. I'm. It is more after uh, Crush and Finding Nemo, but you no. Know. Well, hello, dude. I'm like way too far away from fight, oh, Finding Nemo. Oh, here it is. It's been a long time since so Finding awesome. Nemo. Level one, I win. Poppy. 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 So, name's Crush. Well, killed the motor, dude. We're all doing that, okay? Okay, so if I were if I were to cast it at a higher level, does that take away from that particular? Like, say it's a level one, but I cast it as a level three. Does that take away the ability to cast from a level three, or is that casting away from a level one? It takes away your ability to cast. It takes away a level three spell slot. Well, no. I've never been a, a spellcaster. Okay, well, okay but what's what, uh, what? What's your reasoning behind cast it at level three, but because it only takes up a I'm level thinking... one spell slot? That's broken as hell. Well, that's a, that's why I'm asking. It, it's a level. It's listed as a level one. Right. I mean, if you want to cast it at a higher level, you spend the spell slot of a higher level to do so. It's not just like, oh, I'm going to cast at level 3, but only use a level 1 spell slot. That's going to be broken. Can't. In it. That's gonna, that'll, break the, that'll break the game. Because then you'll just cast a... a you'll, you'll get the effects of a level 9 spell while only using a level 1 spell slot. And why would you not do that? Just do that every all the time. You'd have unlimited level nine spells. That's broken as hell, girl. Can't believe I have to explain that to you. I thought you were a human being. Nice. <clears throat> oh well, she well, didn't spell Oakley with a Y, so that's fine. Okay, one last thing. Um I'm good, because that's all you get. One last thing. Okay, okay, fine. Uh, for example, Thunder Wave. First, it's level one 
evocation. But I want to cast it at, say, a level 3. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How do you activate a higher level ability here? When you cast a spell using a spell slot level 2 or higher, the damage increases 1d8 for each right. slot. So how, how do okay. I... Okay, so 1 plus what equals 3? So it would be, what, 2d8 then? It would be an additional 2d8 plus whatever the base damage is. So for so if I roll that nine there, I'd also roll a two D. What? Oh. I love you like a love song, baby. Okay. I, I love you like a love song. Is it constant? It is constant. It is a cover. Still got a wave. Great. Let's get it on then. Now that Chili's finally figured out what she's doing. <clears throat> oh, I always love it when that happens. <laughs> hmm. Target uplink, maybe. Oh, fuck that hurt like hell. Huh. <clears throat> 30 feet away from you. Alright. Once per dawn. But it's for a minute. That's 10 rounds. Eh. You, you, uh, no. You can get like one. Or maybe like two rounds. Well, you get when you get one round, you land a blow, then you do flurry of blows. So that's three attacks right there. Wait, all of, all of which are gonna. Why would it trigger a flurry of blows? Wait, what now? Why would it trigger flurry of blows? No, landing a blow triggers can trigger flurry of blows if you spend a key point. So why would yeah. you? So why oh. would you not? You land your first blow, then oh. you do flurry of blows, and that's three attacks with your eldritch maul. All right, so you make three attacks. <laughs> right, but I'm saying that's broken as hell. I know. <laughs> but like, right, so you're not doing it. <laughs> so that's a game. Well, no, hold on. No, hold on. Flurry of Blows is a bonus action, so you can either do your Eldritch Maul, or you can do Flurry of Blows. But you can't do both. Okay. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah. Alright, alright. That's more reasonable now. Yeah. I'll, I'll drop it down to we'll 30 seconds, and we're good. 30 seconds. Okay. Yo. So, five turns. That's fair. Yes. And I still get the bonus to unarmed uh, attack damage and rolls. Correct. Right. Well, it okay. says your melee weapon attacks, not unarmed. Uh, so matter. it's just tendrils of ink launched from your weapon or unarmed strike toward the target. I don't know what that's about. Right? That just that's, gives you that just gives you that, reach. Ball like forms and, and, and other jagged shapes. While the tattoo is on your skin, your breaks are considered well, magical for the next the paragraph. With the next paragraph, Eldritch Mall. Yeah, see, this is not this is not a very good description here. For the duration, each of your melee weapon attacks can reach a target from thirty feet away. As tendons of ink launch from your weapon or unarmed strike. In addition, your melee weapon attacks deal an extra 1d6 force damage. Doesn't say unarmed. So. Yeah, that's fine. That's not what I was asking for. The first line is what I care about. I have a, I have a melee weapon. I'm just. The empower. Oh, right. Okay. The, the first paragraph is what I like. <laughs> oh, you just like the flavor. That's fine. I don't care. Yeah, it can be magical. That doesn't bother me. And the plus one. Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes, dear. Change the characters. Yas, queen. So you're already going to have this attuned to you? 
Yes, it's going to be on my skin already. If you have multiple magic tattoos, they count as a single magical item. No, they do not. <laughs> that I tell be you, I'm reading okay. this Unearthed Arcana shit, and I'm like, this is bullshit. <laughs> that you... would be a little bullshit, yeah. I mean, it makes sense to me. Oh, it makes total sense if you just want to be an OP min max well, piece of shit, yeah. No, because look, if 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 every magical tattoo just counts as one magical tattoo, then when you use it, all the magical tattoos are gone. They disappear? No, they they or they're like on cooldown or whatever. Some of them disappear. I saw some of them that disappeared and some of them that just kinda go on cooldown like this one. I don't know. I feel like that's the balance right there is if you have multiple magical tattoos, yes, they can only count as one magical item, but if you use one, you're putting them all on cooldown, essentially. Ah. I feel, I feel like that's how it should work, but maybe maybe I'm just adding balance to Unearth Arcana where there is none. Yeah, so, but it doesn't matter because you don't have multiple. Exactly. So... Alright. So we good on questions? Ready to go? Uh just let me put this into my character sheet. Okay. Alright. Other um okay. That's the least fur bulb looking character. She's almost eight. That is Don't worry about it. actually most definitely an elf. Don't worry about it. Uh, okay. Don't worry oh, about okay. It. You want to play a furbolg, but but you know when it comes to that elf pussy, she nobody. <laughs> she, <laughs> like, wow. she wants to be a smooth, recently nared furbolg who looks a lot like an elf. Yeah. I see. Classic chili. I told you she was a lesbian. I told you this like years ago. But yeah, actually, you know what? Yep. Oh, uh... Yep. I can see it. Yep. Me too. Look at I. I bet she's got a whole closet full of flannel. Terrible. No. Definitely. <laughs> flannel. Definitely. No. Flannel. No. I got flannel bed sheets. No. That's as far as I'm willing to go. No. That's only the yep. government. It's really well, Maryland in the winter, man. You you would love it. You would love it. That's kind of hot. It is it's, it is hot actually. I have to sleep with the fan on. Oh shit! I have to turn the fan on too. God damn it! Why can't I remind you? This Unarmed strike. Uh, we're gonna add a bonus plus one here. Damage, and to attack. Oh, it's just gonna make things so much easier. And then add an attack called Eldritch. Eldritch Maw. Eldritch. Eldritch. Eldritch Blast. Deal a, an extra force damage. Okay. Uh, Eldritch Maw. Uh, that'll be Dex. Uh, slashing will be this. Mediocre. Ain't no mediocre. No? You mediocre mortals. No, oh, gosh. Don't start with that. <laughs> Why the man is dead, you? okay? The man is, like, way, way dead. And I thought about leaving him alive so we could have, like, a, a re-encounter, but no. The man is, like, <clears throat> super duper dead. Yeah, Unless he's gonna get re uh, Yeah, yeah. Uh, there's no resurrection spells in my world. 
Oh, that's good. That, uh, that's that's. Or is there net? That's not Necromia? true, Sinon. <laughs> There's plenty of resurrection spells. There's like a million of them. <clears throat> Um, oh, of okay. Okay. I so, am the red. So, if you're fast forwarding this through the YouTube video, 25 minutes in is when we actually start this session. <laughs> Thank you for your patience. I hope that we've been entertaining for these 25 minutes. But now it's time for no fun and only stress. What? <laughs> wow. Whoa. That ain't cute. Right. You so. Wait. You both wake up, you go about your day, do your things. <clears throat> whether, uh, whether Oakley does her activities in the woods and what do we got? Rania, Rania decides Rania. <clears throat> Rania goes about her own business. And there's a slight blurring, almost like a almost like an afterimage effect on you. And things go black. And then you find yourself lying on a floor with wooden tiling. Slightly overgrown. Walls around you with crackling sigils and glyphs. As you take a look up, you see that the walls are at least ten feet high. You see a clear, sunny day. A little bit of clouds. You look around. You see a few bodies. Don't look like they're moving. And at some point, you'll see each other. Right. There are three walls and one wall that has a door in it. Hmm. Rania is going to. Uh... Are we tied up? We're not nope. tied up. Not at all. Right. You still have all your items. Interesting. Alright. Uh, God damn it, Evan. What have you got me into now? God fucking shit, dude. I told you I was done with this stuff. You hear me, Evan? I told you I was done. Get me the fuck out of here. Ugh. Fucking asshole. <laughs> The fuck? <laughs> Evan? Is that Chili or Oakley? <laughs> Evan? This both is not of us. <laughs> All right. I, like, I told you I was done with this shit. Um, can I help you? <laughs> oh, what's up? Um, I don't did, know what did, 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 he, did he get to you too? I, Look, you, sure. I, I, I don't know how much you know about Evan, but you really can't be dragged into his schemes, man. Like they're all, all scams. Like I, you have to, you just have to get the, get, get clean, get out, <laughs> do what I did. Like it, you're gonna end up here a lot more often, is what I'm saying. Like you can't. He's a, he's a good guy at the inside, but like he just, no, no sense of, of judgment and reason, really. It's 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 a problem. Was in the I was just in, I was just in the woods, you know. I was just, you know <laughs> gathering some herbs, and then I blink, and then you're here. I'm here, and there's a door, and I kind of don't want to be in here because you, you're you're kind of freaking me out there a little bit, there, bud. Yeah, this this has happened before. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, what? <laughs> this, this, this kind of thing kind of, like, for first you're talking to him about, like, a heist or, like, a certain magical item that may or may not be traveling from a museum to somewhere else. 
Um, and then you say, no, Evan, we're not going to steal shit anymore. We're done with that life. And then you wake up in the fucking guard cell or, um, one time I, I woke up tied to the edge of a cliff, you know, that, holy shit, that was a, anyway, all I'm saying is get, get clear of Evan. I'll, I'll get us out of here. We're probably just on the outskirts of a city. It's not that big a deal. All right. This promise. He, he he's just an idiot. He's he doesn't know what he's doing. He really zero sense of judgment. I don't know what scam he proposed to you, but t- trust me, I have experience. We're we'll be fine. All right, and with that, um, Ronnie is gonna walk up to the door and try to open it. All right, you walk up. Yeah, I him. <laughs> Yeah, what's up, Chili? I'm just gonna definitely keep at least ten feet of distance between us, you know? <laughs> just kinda <laughs> throwing it out there. Just cause this guy seems to be, like, tripping on something, you know? Oh, just okay. Got, okay. Got, into, got into the, tr- got into the oh, truth a little bit. Vanya's just done with, with Evan's shit, man. This is not the first time this has happened to her. I'm using Talia's that what you icon, will. icon for right now, by the way. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. So you watch, uh, Oakley watches as Rania goes up and starts to open the door. She, you, and Rania, uh, not Rania, Oakley watches as a small pink little moat sweeps down and moves and sort of circles around, almost, almost, makes almost like a semicircle around Rania's head. And uh, eventually it'll zip in and not obstruct you or anything, but it'll get close to the door. Which is a double door, as you start to open it. The door opens without, without issue. It's not locked. Doesn't uh, particularly creak or release. Uh, I mean, resist you opening it, and you see. Oops. There you go. As you open the door, you see a hallway on your left, a hallway on your right, and another door across the hallway. And you hmm. see, uh, and you both now see the small little pink moat that was dashing over. Drain this so I can actually see what the fuck I'm doing. Huh. What a good idea. Ah. Uh. Shit. Is this another maze? Fuck. Another maze? I'm, I'm telling you, this shit happens all the time. You shouldn't have gotten involved with Evan, but it's not your fault. You couldn't have known. But I've known this kid for, a, like... God, it must have been, like, 15 years now. Ugh. Fucking, uh... Should have never introduced him to that creepo by the black market. Let's just say that. Uh, uh, okay, you know. Uh, all right, you know what? Yeah. They always say take left first, so let's go left. <laughs> all right. Uh, yeah, you lead the way. All right. Good. That's a good idea. I have more. I have more experience in these situations. Um. Alright, so I guess we'll head left. Yes, so you do in fact do that. <laughs> you do in fact do uh, that. I, yeah, I'm, just, I'm, I'm working with pen and paper notes because this was for an actual real life sit down here. Oh, really? Yeah, 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 That's yeah. Cool. You're gonna hear it. Well, it, yeah, it was. Unfortunately, I can't do some of the stuff I wanted to do. Anyway, so you walk, and at the end of the corridor, there is a large teleportation circle that oh, is glowing. No. It's got a slight greenish tint to it. But that is the only thing that's in the room. Uh, the uh, small... It looks very obviously magical, right? It looks very obviously magical. About as magical as the sigils and glyphs on the walls. 
Anya's gonna look like there's a headache coming on, and she's gonna put her te- her head in her hands and start massaging her temples, like, God, damn it, not mages again, not mages again, not mages again. Not. And she's gonna start muttering to herself. What's wrong with mages? Well, there was this time with this cult and the, the fucking <laughs> wizard and this this... This dude had, like, tentacles for arms, and it was just, like, the, 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 the transmutation spell, and, uh, and uh, bad, bad memories, man. Don't try to steal from wizards. Don't try to steal from wizards. Bad idea. Still working in the cultists already. Nice. Well, I don't know what to call, like, a coven? I don't know. Okay, I don't it was care. a coven of wizards. You were all about cultists and demons. You just bring that. Yes, with Talia. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Full circle. <laughs> I just don't know what else to call them. Okay. Like, what do you call okay. a group of wizards? A tower? A tower? <laughs> An order? <laughs> like. Oh, whatever you want to call them. This a is congregation a whole, of virgins? A parliament. A parliament. There you go. <laughs> They're like owls. Yes. Only if you twist their heads 180 degrees, <laughs> they just snap. Parliament of owls, a creep of turtles, a pot of whales, a blessing of unicorns, a murder of ravens. List a thunder up. of dragons. There you go. Say, behind it. All right. So there. So you see the uh, obviously magical circle. Okay. So what does what does Oakley look like? She got a staff on her. Is she like? Does anything packing. scream magic user? Is she packing? Indeed. Is she packing? Because, you know, I don't mind the, the tranny situation, you know, as long as they got something to put up in me, it's fine. On that note... <laughs> I don't really know what Can't, Aren't you a druid? Couldn't druids just, like, kind of give themselves the dick? Aww. I feel like that's a possibility as a druid. Anyway, moving on. Go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead. So, um, I'm. I've got a scimitar and a mace with my leather armor. Uh, I've got my druidic focus in my bag, my cloak, and explorer's pack. You don't have a staff for shillelagh? No, I have a scimitar and a mace. Okay. So I have no idea you're a magic user. Gotcha. Nope. No. Um. <laughs> okay. Um, so I was able to cast something, but yeah, you would know. You would not know. Fair enough. Huh. Well, I've had my hands on many a valuable magical item, but um, I'll be honest, no idea how to work any of this shit. So uh, moving on, and she's gonna stomp her way back and back through the corridor. Because there's no door in the. There's no door in the which, which you call it portal room, right? Right. Okay. Yeah. Just just gonna turn around, head back the way we came, and head right. Okay. You watches around it, makes a one eight, goes past the intersection, and then walks to the other end when there is a portal. With, looks like a teleportation circle on the bottom of it that's glowing. A pale, strong moon. I'm assuming we've moved, so I'm just gonna kinda lie. <sighs> okay. Um. You wanna jump in the portal? <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors for it? It's boulder parchment shoes. Ronnie is gonna look at Oakley like she's batshit crazy for wanting to jump into an unknown portal that could lead wherever. Well, what's the fun like, that? lady, have you ended ever ended up on another fucking plane for like a year? That shit fucking sucks. Like, no. By the way, this is like a halfling that's like so basically like, half your size. I would say I'm seven seven feet nine inches yeah. tall. Yeah, I'm like half your size. But I got a personality to match. (laughs) 
mama didn't raise no fucking pushover. Anyway. Yes, I will see conflict with this one. <laughs> anyway. Um, yeah. Lady, have you ever, like, jumped through an unknown portal and ended up, like, on another plane for a while? Because that well, shit fucking sucks. Obviously, I... Obviously, I touched something and ended up on another plane here with you. So... I think this is another plane. Usually, the one... Well, the one I was at was, like, lots and lots of fire. Lots and lots of fire. Hurt like hell. She's gonna raise raise up her... Basically, a shirt. She's not wearing any armor. And, like, show this massive burn on her stomach. See? See what I mean? Like, elementals and shit? Like, nah, man. Not fun. Not trying that again. No, sir. Mm-mm. Just gonna snicker and be like, <laughs> you're in for a surprise. So, um, so, if you don't want to go into that portal, maybe we should go the other way, see what happens when we go the other direction. Well, I guess we could try to open the door. Well, do we... But it might be booby-trapped, you know. Well, I... So let me go first. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh, good. All right. I'm just about. gonna try to open the door. No, oh, lordy. All right. The door opens without issue. And inside, you see what looks like a slightly dipped pit of sand. Like we're in the middle, and it's lower than you. Outside. But this, this huh. That's it. It's a circular room. It's uh, three, maybe four hundred feet across. And the sand goes all the way up to the walls. And then there's, no, there's no rim. What the fuck am I looking at, Strippy? I guess, I guess we'll walk in. Forward. I'll walk in. There are a few bodies, little bits of like arms and legs that you can see, mostly stripped. Uh, I will get the new thing up here in a second. Why am I looking at face huggers? Because that because those are the new mask styles. I will move you over to the new map if I have to refresh. Oh no! What the hell is wrong with people, man? It, isn't that that's kind of slutty, isn't it? Because we all know what it does in the movie, right? It's, it does look really slutty. It, it sticks its penis down her mouth and makes her swallow eggs. And people are going to wear a face mask with the... the, the that is yeah. Yep. I yeah. I don't want to hear that. Well, that's what it does in the oh, movie, Oh, Chili's so innocent. I know. She's just a little virgin. Is it really a penis? I didn't want that. I don't think it, it qualifies as a penis. I think it would just be an ovipositor. Uh, okay, it, okay, probably, but it was like late 70s, so it's definitely sexual. So we're gonna call it a penis. It's also, definitely also, a penis. Also, that's what <laughs> late I Late 70s. <laughs> definitely a penis. Have you not seen any <laughs> other late 70s movies? Like... There's like tits in every movie. I'm gonna... What are those? Called? True. I'm just gonna send you guys one of those like portable vaginas so you can like. Oh, a flashlight? A portable Why would I want that, though? Well, oh, she, well she's buying all hey, That's called a female? That's 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 what a woman is called. Yeah, yeah, those ones, yeah those ones clean themselves. They're self-cleaning and self-heating. It's nice. Yep. And self-lubricating. Yeah, yeah. Why would I want a flashlight? That doesn't make any Most sense. Most of the time, unless she's like 90. <laughs> Not what I turned up for her. Oh, you started this, Jilly. Oh, no, yeah. <laughs> All I did was ask, why am I looking at a face hugger? Because well, I you were, were told. Important. You yeah. shouldn't have asked. I, I felt that it was an important use of our time. It also just chokes you, too. Like, the tail. Just, it, Jesus. Well, it's just until it deposits the eggs, and then it dies. So where are we in the circle of fun here? Right. Uh, do Oakley and Talia. You are at the south end. Oops. At the 
south end, right at the entrance. Now I can't I can't crop the sand, so just the circle is what you have to worry about. Well, guess yeah, Ronnie is gonna be like Evan and just scream it out. <laughs> I'm not gonna scream in my apartment though. Aww. What the fuck, dude? Like, what have you gotten in us into now? Ugh, fucking, shh, I'm gonna kill that kid again. Ugh, I'm gonna have to pay for revivify though. God damn it, ah, oh, motherfuckers, bitch. <sighs> yeah, walk into the thing, look around, call out. Uh, how far are you going to go in? All the way in. Like That's the, the only way to go. Yes. I'm okay. going to maintain fi 15 feet here. <laughs> uh, Alright, so we're going <laughs> to... Or 20, yeah. Start here at the beginning. We're both, you can both roll initiative. Oh, goddamn. Queen. Let me select my character, make sure I do it right this time. Ronnie is super lesbian, by the way. Really? Cool. I right? With, I can work with that. Whoops, I just deleted your frickin' tune. Really? <laughs> I just gotta add it back, I'll just make it at a 9. It's fine. You rolled a 21? What the fuck? I have a plus 4 to initiative. I have one. I have one. <laughs> you sure. have four. That is both. Yeah, I've eighteen in decks. All right. Well, good. I'm glad that you're not uh, having any problems with the cross counter or the cross character clicking. So, uh, Rania starts walking across. Gets uh, gets gets far. Pretty far. Oakley follows, and you're just about ready to start walking across, and a wave of sand emanates from the middle, <clears throat> and you. It's probably a dex check. I will double check my notes though. Fuck. What the fuck? What the fuck? Yes, it is in fact a dexterity check to keep your balance. So, go ahead and do that for me. Dexterity doll. saving throw? Dexterity saving throw for both of you. Yes, yes, yes. Jeez. Okay. <laughs> no, that's cool. Well, that's totally cool. Plus seven? What? Oh my god. Okay. Um, well, whatever. So I have minus proficiency in, in deck saving throws. Uh, well, whatever mine is, it's plus one here. Twelve. Just with my cloak. Alright. Oh, Aw, <laughs> oh, I should have nice. done this. Fuck. Damn it, I forgot I had a cantrip. Alright, so... Oh, this is gonna be a recurring theme, isn't it? <laughs> so... Uh, Rania is moved ten feet inwards as the sand swirls around and seems to pick her up and move her forward. Oakley is moved ten feet forward and is now prone as you're laying flat in the sand, getting a little bit of grit in your teeth as you uh, eh, 
Okay. As you, uh, okay. as sand sort of pulls you along. It's, you know, it, it's kind of a, it's a natural emulsion. I suppose you could be okay with it. Oh, stop being a bitch. There, fine. Okay. We'll go back to the top of the turn with dearest Rania. <clears throat> What would you like to do? Um, guess I'll just give a look around. Hello? Believe the sand. Hold you in, buddy. <laughs> just, just, a, look, just a man, little hunt. Just a little this hunt. Shit, this shit isn't funny anymore. Get it? You guys want something? If it's payment, I'm broke. I can't really help you there, but I can totally tell you where he lives. Um, I have no qualms about that. Uh, but really, really, I have I have nothing to do with this. It's all his fault. Uh, I didn't do anything. So you could just, like, if you just want to talk to me and let me go, that would be great. I got shit to do tomorrow. You watch as a small pink moat circles around you as you speak, and then darts over to Oakley. Uh, Otherwise, there's but... no reaction or no sound or anything. Well, that's your turn. So, Oakley, what are you going to do on your turn? Listening um, to Rania yeah. to start yelling. Uh, for shits and giggles, I'm going to go ahead and use this on me. Uh, just in case. <laughs> okay. Because I don't know what's coming. You cast bark skin on yourself. You feel your skin toughen up. Yeah. Start to get uh, Raises my thing. walnut or oak bark-like protrusions across your skin. Knuckles get a little bit tighter to move in your joints. But you now look a little bit like a living tree. And both of you need to give me a deck save again. Yeah, I'm trying to make sure I didn't have any bonus. I don't think I did, though. Oh, no. Alright. That's or, 10 feet, and you rough. are prone. So now that I'm prone, does light. Okay, never mind. 11. Alright, okay. 10 so feet I'm forward. Move to 10 feet. You both, um, unable to keep your yeah. feet, yeah. unable to keep your feeding, I mean footing, in the, in the moving sand, are both pretty much on your asses as you watch vibrations come out from the center point around the circle, and you slide downwards another ten feet. And we're back at the top with Rania, Rania. stand back up on my feet okay. uh, is... yeah funny guys funny at all son of a well, poxy whore we're moving towards the center perhaps we should you know head there yeah <laughs> either, <laughs> that too. Either, head, either head there or aim an attack there maybe you know if we have any do you have anything that can you can do at a distance, like throwing something, you know. I don't know. Honey is just gonna look at Oakley and raise an eyebrow. Because uh, like, uh, what happens when we get to the center? You know, maybe we just, you know, get suffocated by sand. You know, have you ever been in a whirlpool? You know how water works? Sand's the same concept. Do you know how water works? No. No, toots. I got two fists, a hatchet, and some darts. That's about it. So if you got something you can throw to that hand, maybe you should think about it. But like, I don't see what I don't see what my fists are gonna do to some sand. 
Are you just retarded? Are you just retarded? Like, what is your, like, intelligence? <laughs> I don't know, lady. You're the one talking about attacking sand okay, here. My passive wisdom is 17 perception. Can I see anything in the center at this point? No, you cannot. Would I have to roll for that? <laughs> sure. Well, you can roll with advantage. Uh... Roll with triple advantage. Don't matter. You can't see <laughs> Sign up for you thing. You did. I, I, okay. I'll be happy to give you some hints about this after you leave the room. <laughs> Not before. After you leave. Oh, great. I okay. can give you nothing. Um, what happens if we? What if? What if we? What if you tried coming towards me? You know, away from the center. You know, tried to leave the room here. What happened? You know, because ever since we stepped into this room is when we got pulled towards the center. What happens if we try to go the other way? Shorts. Short stack. <laughs> That's you, Zion. So when we could just leave. Okay. And not the case. You want to? I guess. Try it? Oh, right. All right. Let's let's try to leave. All right. And then corpse in the. And I guess we'll just head. I'll just head back towards the door. Of course. Go ahead and give me another dexterity check. Both of you. Oh my god. Both of us every time someone moves? Is that Oh god, that that's not a. That's yeah. not good. Oh no, no, that's a natural one. Wait. Holy shit stacks. No, I can re roll that. I can, I can re roll that. That's I can true. re roll that. That's true. That's true. Because I'm lucky. All out. Oh, this is going to be so much fun. Oh, it's not going to work, but it's still better than a nat one. How about an 18? How does an 18 work for me? 18. All right. So, well, uh, you did you stand up? I don't remember. I don't think you did. No, I was. Yeah, I was still prone. All right. So you're moving at half speed. So you move 15, and then you get pulled back 10. Oh, we just crawling the across the ground. So you move all of five feet, and you're still prone. Uh, 11 is. Uh, you move. You can move 30. Let's see. Right. Four. Uh, six, and you're pulled back to when you're knocked from him, as the sand swirls around you and your feet slip and slide the constantly changing surface, soft surface. Even... And you're... So is that, uh, his, is that the end? You watch as Oakley makes almost no progress, and... Rania makes some progress. No progress with an 18 or anything? Jesus. Okay. Well, you weren't knocked prone. That's... That's that's a success. You weren't knocked prone. Congratulations. I mean, okay, okay, but nothing's attacking me either other than sand. Right. So. You're not taking any damage either, so... You're just, you know, suffering with your pride a little bit because you can't seem to stand up. It's yeah, my turn. Sense. It's not my turn. Is it that is Andy technically it's. Uh, that is okay. Yeah, technically it's Ronnie's turn first. I mean, it's back to my turn. Right? Yeah. yeah. But I'll just keep trying to head towards the door, I guess. Had another dexterity check. When it gets, when, you can roll one now, sure. Oakley, what do you want to do? Um, I want to detect magic if I can. See if. Um... Want to use one of my... You have detect magic and you didn't use it when the sand started moving? Well, I was kind of seeing what all was happening first, you know. Plus, I wanted to protect myself the first rounds. But, yeah, this is one of my cantrips here is detect magic. You can cast detect magic as a cantrip? Interesting. It's a racial ability. It's not a cantrip, per se. Well, Anyways. what minute? Interesting. It is. Very interesting. Uh, you don't. It's only thirty feet. You you don't sense anything within thirty thirty feet of you that's magical. There's there's maybe just oh. the faintest of auras from a couple of these bodies that are nearby. But... And it can't tell me, and I can't 
tell what kind of auras or anything like that? Uh, yeah, you can with Detect Magic, but I don't remember what all the fucking schools of magic are. Fucking chilly. It is. <laughs> Light transmutation to them. Yeah, I'm, to, I'm also gonna try and back out if I can. No, well, you were both back in the process. The <clears throat> okay. Well, so I've you are my you... movement. My movement. Right, that's what you've been doing. But you're so you uh you're still crawling, so it's half speed. So you move fifteen feet. And now you both make a deck save. Yes, sir. Yes, Daddy. Mm -hmm. Jesus. <laughs> oh, poor Oakley. I have a plus seven. Alright, well it's a good thing you didn't stand up. Yeah, you pulled back ten feet. Not very bad, feet. <clears throat> oh my god. And I, I switched to Rania, by the way, and you, I don't, I don't think you stood up this time, but anyways, you are not knocked prone, regardless of whether you're standing up, stand up, or it's still my prone. turn. Okay, so you are not knocked prone, you managed to keep your footing, you move back ten, and you were both right by each other, as this situation is dangerous, yet still somewhat frustrating, as with the repetitive nature of it. So, Jesus. Uh, it is now Rania's turn. Reach the door is the question. The, it's like, well, uh, we can go 15, but if What we, is my so speed? You... I gotta just calculate my speed real quick. No, because I'm a monk. That's true. Uh, a lot. <clears throat> 40 feet. So, I guess I'll just dash to the door. Okay. Do I even need to? No, I don't. No, you don't. Okay. I... Okay, so you watch as Rania just books it. Technically not a dash, but, you know. And just books it and jumps right up to the doorway. And, presumably, turns back to you. Uh, turns back to Oakley, rather. <clears throat> you see the you see a small pinkish moat dash from where Rania is to over to Oakley. And hover around and spin very frenetically. <clears throat> it is now, like <laughs> it's, now your, it's now your turn, Oakley. Okay. Um, can I dash to the Oops. or I can only go 15, right? Cuz I'm only cuz I'm still You are prone, so your movement speed is halved. If you want to dash, that's 30 feet. Yeah, I'll da I'll go ahead and take my dash then. Okay. That would be. Would you go ahead and, and with some with things. some furious crawling. Yeah. You you cross the distance. You wind up on the in the doorway. Right on the lip of this sand vortex. Of sorts. And you both stand there for a moment. The pinkish moat surrounds you, or not surrounds you, uh, circles you slowly as you watch. There's no more disturbances in the sand. In the forest? What? What the hell? That was strange, that's for sure. Telling you. 
we're messing with mages, and it's never it never ends well. It never ends well. Well, you want to come in the doorway. Well, what did you? What, I didn't hear you offering any other solutions. Toots. The other, uh, yeah, the other, the right. Yeah, oh, going into the strange portal. Yes, good idea. Yeah, and good then going idea. and then going back towards the right because it. The little cave thing we're in went left and right, and we went left first. So I often. And then we went right. No, and then we went to the doorway. We never no, went no, first. you went to the right. Went, you went to the right first. Went to the right, and there was another portal. Yep. Or another teleportation circle. Come on, Jelly. <laughs> I thought I thought he said that. There's a portal on both sides. One is green. One is blue. Mm. Let's just go in the portals. Because I, I, I feel like a portal would be much safer than a death by sand drowning. <laughs> so there was, the, the floorboards were overgrown, right? It's it, it's a stone uh, parve, kind of cobblestone, a little bit more, uh, a little more. Like, but there's like than plant growth on but the. Yes, there, there's plant growth. There's there's little cracks in it on the floor, not so much on the walls. Can I rip a vine? Can I rip rip a vine off the floor? Yeah. Yeah, you can probably find something that's, uh, you know, oh, like it's, 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 it's not, well, it's not a guarantee that it's going to hold your weight, but there's certainly enough vine growth to... No, I just want to rip something, like... Okay, yeah, that's fine, like absolutely, you can vine, rip some vine. Like yeah, yeah, type. Some sort of creeping ivy. Okay. Whatever. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely, yes. I'll rip some of that off the floor, uh -huh. and then walk up to the portal and stick it through. Alright, you toss it through. It hits the... No, no, it's sticking it through. I'm holding it there. Okay, okay. You and hold it. pulling it out. And, and pull it out. It, it's... Seeing if anything changes. There's no change in color or pulse. The, uh, the vines are still in your hand. They don't disappear when they enter the circle. Okay. Nothing. There's no noticeable change. Some big idea. Look, Tuts, you got a lot to say, but you haven't done much. <clears throat> so why don't you just shut it, unless you have an actual good idea? Uh, my idea is going into the portal. Well, then why don't you go first, my lady? Well, you're trying to look if you're trying to do something. I was letting you finish what you're trying to do. You know. Courteousness. By all means, don't let me hold you back. <clears throat> Alright, pick a color though. Blue or green. Purple. <laughs> really? Really? Why would I want blue or green? Purple's best color. That was the two portal colors that we could choose from. Ah. Well, green's next best. Very well. Green, it shall be. DM. Okay. Well, not Rania. Oakley heads over to the green portal. Are you going to follow her? Yes. Okay. I'm just going to walk. <clears throat> you watch as... Oakley walks over to the green portal, stands in it. You watch a, a, a soft pulse happen, and then Oakley pops and disappears. That her head pops? No, just just sort of like popped out of there with with a wink. Not like explodes with blood and gore. Just... Although that would be a good opener. All right, Chili, make a new character. <laughs> yeah, yeah, go ahead. Well, it took me so long. It took me so long. <laughs> no, it's fine. 
<clears throat> so you, uh, whatever your name is, Oakley, find yourself standing in a small alcove with a pathway leading out to what looks like something kind of naturey. Ooh, looks, it looks kind of looks kind of green. Uh, trees look weird from where you are, but it's like at least forty or fifty feet away. <clears throat> um. Wait, Tuts, you all right? I... Can you hear me? You, you do not hear her. I don't know. Can I hear him? Do you? you do not hear no. her at all. Okay. Um. Is that portal still there? Like, if I were to it, go it's, back... Uh, it's, it? it's glowing, and it's... It's glowing. It looks kind of like the other one did before you stepped in it. Can I take, like, ten foot... Ten feet forward? And detect magic? You move one... Two, three... Oh, uh, ten feet rather. Okay, so you move forward. To, um, 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 I have you on a different map, but I haven't showed it to you yet. Okay. I suppose I could. Um, let me, uh, That's up to you. Yeah, I'm, I'm well aware. Let me, uh, let me hide the rest of the area first. And I'll let you see it. <clears throat> yes, turn on the fog. Oh, you bitch. Fine. You're a slut. My roommate Dorothy told me that. She's a slut. Alright, there. So that's, that's what you see? You Is she? You, you ten <laughs> sure. So you uh, take ten feet away, you cast Tech Magic. The portal is giving off magic, but nothing else within 30 feet. I guess I'll just hang out, see if uh, my companion falls through, since I went through. Okay. Uh, you, uh, you decide to twiddle your thumbs for a moment, maybe take a peek out at the other stuff, while we cut back to dearest Rania. What you doing? So she hasn't gone back through? She has not come back through. Magic. All right, she's just gonna like take a hold her breath and then jump through the portal. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> All right, there is uh. And come out swinging. <laughs> <laughs> yes. All right, so you watch as there's a slight pop, and Rania comes out of the portal that you were that you came out of. And I moved you back over. There we go. Whoops. And you you both see each other. Huh. You're not dead. <laughs> Guess that's good. Anything stand out here, or just a I weird forest? I didn't detect any magical senses nearby. Um, just the portals. Yeah, just I just noticed just the portals. Um, perhaps if I go this way a little bit, so 5, 10, 15-ish feet. If I'm going to go 15 feet here out of this little alcove, uh, I'm going to go ahead and do a... Um, where's it at? Perception check here. Just kind of look around for... Okay. Yeah. You, you take a moment, gather your senses, and focus on what little light you can see. Uh, there's looks like there's some bioluminescent. Lessons, um, doesn't look like there's much uh, light coming from above. 
Uh, but, but the bioluminescents kind of have a, a, a mushroomy shape to them. A little bit kind of like the, um, with the caps and, and the lack of branches. And there's a few other little natural cues that you get. Uh, but it doesn't really look like anything too scary or, or intimidating or anything. It just kind of looks like there's a lot of fungus. <clears throat> Maybe even a fungal forest. <clears throat> it feels like it feels like home. It's not quite home, but it's it feels like it. There's, there's nothing... I, I don't see anything out here. If you want to you wanna tag along. Live in a mushroom? No, I don't live in a mushroom. It's, I mean, but it's all nature out here. Huh. But, yeah. Seems peaceful. So you far. tall folk are real weird. We just are in tune with nature. Yeah, real weird. <laughs> no, you want some weird? I'll show you some weird. Oh, don't turn me on now. <laughs> We're in a dangerous situation, Missy. I can show you what I know later. Yeah, no, I'm good. <laughs> no, I'm good. Is she blushing? No. Make a perception no, check. Definitely not. Oh, okay. Definitely. No. Oh. Well, maybe if we'll sign up gets a really low you perception. Maybe if he gets a really low perception. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, if you do, you'll be like, I see a little bit of flushing. I don't know why Oakley's rolling, but whatever. What? <laughs> no, that was... Ronnie is trying to see if you're blushing, so I said make a perception check. But if you're yeah. just, but if you're genuinely not interested, there's no reason that you're no, blushing. No, I'm gen uh, yeah, I'm genuinely not interested. Okay, no. so I was just saying, unless <laughs> Synod wants to roll with the intent of getting a low roll and being like, I see some blushing, even though there's none, that no. would be funny. But if he doesn't want to, he doesn't have to. I'm just trying to start some shit. <laughs> Obviously. Obviously, that's totally my mo. Anyway, yes. um, I'm gonna move another 30 feet, and then, oh, cancel that, and then, when I get here, I'm gonna go ahead and transform. Okay. Um, I'm you gonna watch. go ahead and become panther. Alright, you transform into a panther. You watch as the small pinkish moat of light swirls around you, and seems to go over your form, almost tracing it a little bit. Now that you're in panther form and, you're, and you've walked into the fungal forest a little bit more, you notice there's some some softer, looks like maybe spheres of bobbing lights that are there in the forest. Couple, maybe a couple of them seem to be moving, but the majority of them are stationary. Um, can I, like... Stealth around, like kind of investigating the area. Roll uh, stealth check. Also, that just so you see that my stealth is supposed to be plus six when I roll it here. So, um, seventeen. Okay, seventeen stealth. Where are you gonna go? Left, right, straight. Yeah. Um. Side to side. I I'm gonna. It's just a jump to the left. Do like a. Hop to the right. Still like. Oh wait, no, my thing will tell me here. Um, I get 50 feet, so let's do... Put your hands on your hips. Uh, your hands on my 15, hips for I punch you in the dick. 30, 30 35. 30, 30, 30, 30. Oh wait, I can go diagonal, can I? No. Just like in real life! Shut up. Yeah. 15. Okay. Okay. Yeah, right. so like, yeah, I'm gonna do some like zigzaggy kind of around here, so like. To, okay. 
Go ahead and... Yeah, there. Move your token. Stealthy, stealthy. Alright, you see some... Lights that are closer on your right. There are a few ahead, and there are some far off to your left. Other than that... All of these things, like right here? Yeah. Okay. Other than that, nobody really seems to have noticed you. Uh, the the uh, the pinkish light has drawn back a little bit. It's it's hovering ten, maybe fifteen feet up and behind you. So, do you want to do anything, Rania? Uh, I'll just follow behind Oakley and look around suspiciously because I don't trust this shit fucking wizards. How close? Um... I'll be just five feet behind her. <laughs> Alright, well you're gonna wind up 20 because she can move faster than you can. In this yeah, I'm, I move 50 feet. Yeah. Can't I move faster than her? Well, you can, yeah, you can dash. Well, oh yeah, you're a monk. I keep forgetting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have five forty moving feet. You'll be fine. Yes, yes. So you, uh, you managed to keep up with her. Uh, are you gonna stealth? I'm not. Well, because it would be way more entertaining if she was and you were not. But okay. <laughs> All right, you follow behind. Oakley the panther, and you uh, you notice you take you take observation of what and where this panther goes. You see a few little bit of little bit of mistakes, okay. a little bit of mistakes that she made, and you you decide to miss those mistakes, and are slightly quieter you feel than the panther it's herself. Both do notice a few strange corpses that seem like they're curled up a little bit more. The the lights are, are moving, but it doesn't seem like they're getting closer or farther away. Try and smell for something. Chili, you can smell for shit. That's true. Oh lordy, I don't smell shit. Okay, but that's <laughs> not what that's not what advantage well, means. Because you can roll yeah. again. Yeah. <laughs> now I can smell something. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. So you <laughs> sniff the air. It is heavy with fungus and spores. A little bit of decay as well. All of it's pretty standard as far as your... Have I not been revealing areas? Shit! Okay. All of it's pretty standard uh, as, as far as forests and and smells go. Uh, there There's no real noise in here though. There's no animals or crickets, no birds, no owls, and, and and the forest has a somewhat heavy, musty smell to it. Hmm. But of course, she cannot communicate that to anyone else right now. Look, I'll just kind of, I'll just look relaxed. Like, kind of sit, look, look, look relaxed. Like, I don't smell okay. anything. Like, All right. Yeah, Rania doesn't deal with animals. Asshole. <laughs> All right. The uh, the panther looks a little bit more at ease, a little bit more at home here, as she wordlessly proceeds onwards. Question mark. What do you want to do? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Another fifty. I'll keep, if I yeah, I'll keep going. Yeah, so 5, 10, 15, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. Yeah, I guess closer to these light things here. Okay. I'll circle around it a little. Are you going to follow her? 
Well, yeah. I gotta oh, keep my area. kitty cat happy. Really? <laughs> How large is this area? Jesus. It's a, it's a forest, Chili. <laughs> So you, uh, you, you walk over to the bobbing lights, and Rania follows. The pinkish moat, and a spear, if you were, you will, follows you around. Doesn't really get in your way, but seems to strafe, maybe pan, alongside of you. Can I bat at it like a cat while I would with a laser pointer? Of course. <laughs> it, it definitely dodges you, almost as if it was expecting it. <laughs> you catch it with like one of your toes maybe once, and it gets a little tingly. But uh, you head over to, toward the bobbing lights. It, there's a small assortment of colors. It's, they're just floating there. There, there's nothing well, there. Well, I'm, I'm looking at the details. Oh. I wanted to see if it had limits. And all right, whatever, whatever. There's, there's several different colors. And you, uh, you get as close as, 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 as you feel it will be safe to do. Uh, and, and they, they, they seem like they're living. They sort of go around and brush up against trees and all sorts of stuff. They move around a bit, maybe swish through the grass. Uh, and, and one of them seems like it's just sort of slowly, kind of like languidly, lazily, floating over towards you. Oh, Wait, Kitty, you seeing this? Yeah, I'll just kind of look at him, swish the tail, just kind of bob my head, and like, me. yeah. Do it, like, kind of would like, just kind of look at him, just kind of look at him, look at him. So, like, kind of indicating I'm looking at him and the bloody things in front of me. Mm -hmm. Alright, it's... I guess. You push forward? I don't know, man. This, this is... I'm starting to think Evan's not involved with this shit. <laughs> Usually I find him tied up in a room somewhere and, you know, weapons... Uh, angry, screaming, that kind of thing. Threats of torture. You know the, you know the like. Um, I guess I will. I guess you will. Uh, oh dear. I'm just trying to back out. And see how far. I don't know. I guess I'll go towards the other lights. So that I remember vaguely seeing towards the left here. I guess. So, Jeez. Uh, okay. Are you I going guess, to? Were you trying to do something there? Were I you... guess I was going. I guess I was kind of going to go this way. Okay. Towards this you... So, thing. all right. So you're going to move away from the spheres yeah. before they yeah. get any closer. Okay. okay. Yeah. And you're going to follow her. Yes, sir. All right. Bellissimo. You, uh... Reveal! <laughs> did I not reveal that area? I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah, I can tell I did. You schmuck. It's... Are we just at the edge of it or something? Yeah, it's it's another it's another very big circular. You, you can see there's a bit of a, of a wall. You don't see anything on it. Looks like there's plenty of fungus and lichen and, and whatnot growing on it. Uh, and, and there's quite now it's quite a strong smell of death. Oh. For you. You definitely smell it. Okay. Ronnie probably gets a little whiff or two. Yeah. Probably doesn't 
immediate, immediately associate it with death. Maybe just smells of this fungal forest. Maybe, but uh, for you, you can definitely smell do it. I, uh, say, do I know which direction it's coming from, it's... or do I need to roll for that? Yeah, go ahead and roll for that. Cause that's I gotta I gotta see how much you're able to glean. In order to decide on the accuracy of that information. Alright. <laughs> Were you trying to do something there, Chili? Alright, so you're... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. So, you're, uh... You're not terribly confident about this. There's, uh... There's a lot of death and decay in this forest. Are you pretty sure it's ahead somewhere, but uh, but that's mostly based on the fact that you walked into the smell, and you know where it wasn't, not so much where it is. Uh, it's more of a process of elimination rather than pointing something out. Uh, the there, A small okay. pink moat continues to make little figure eights above you too and zooms in and sits on your head for a moment. You see a few more other other spheres and orbs of light in the direction that you're currently headed. I will definitely start to kind of get on edge, you know, just kind of do a little growl, just kind of Especially the light things that seem to kind of get closer to us as we moved. You know, just kind of give the appearance that I'm on edge, I guess. Now. Right. Okay. Rania watches as the panther, some, for some reason, gets a little bit more uh, tense and a little bit more on the prowl, the tail flicking impatiently, alertly, actively, even. You're gonna keep going. Hmm. You alright there, kitty? Seem kinda set. Uh, can I just kinda like glance at him, glance at the lights, like kinda uh, like growl. Yeah. No, you gotta role play the growl. A roll better than that. A roll for <laughs> A roll for growl. I don't even how would what is that well, communication? Can, like, what am, what am you I? You can either roll for it or you can act it out. <laughs> <laughs> Wanna? Because I don't want to be in a sex tape later, so no. <laughs> oh well, you're just a fun sponge, aren't you? Right. Thank you. Yeah. Say, typical chili. Alright, fine, but... Please? <laughs> Please? <laughs> Show us your tits. Uh... <laughs> I, I don't... You wanna be shot... You wanna be shot at? I'm sorry. You wanna be shot at? Uh, um... Said anybody... Said anything about shooting people. We don't need to shoot no, nobody here. Is her boyfriend's gonna shoot us if we see her tits, babe. Uh... Uh -huh. Sounds uh -huh. like some unhealthy possessive uh -huh. behavior there. It sounds like he's gonna have to come all the way over to where we are. Not to each their own, I guess. Happen. Do you and then bring a gun. And then which is also not gonna happen. Gosh. Also true, yes. Um, you think that's up? You know, that's not stopped him before, right? No. Well, I not know that. getting over close quarters. <laughs> Uh, during COVID, while also bringing a weapon, is gonna be kinda tough. That's all I'm saying. He's, he's just trying to be practical. Yeah, just practical. It's a good thing you're uh, on his good side, then. Why don't you show him your tits? Uh-huh, yeah. Okay. Oh, just... God. <laughs> he looks 
how many how babies. many how many times did you have to call him up? <laughs> he's got his headphones in, so because uh, he's playing his uh, game, so. <sighs> Shit. That's annoying. So. All right. All right. Yeah. Right. So. so um, where are you gonna Where are you gonna walk to next? Uh, um. And then. Oh, I scrolled way too far. Shit. Um. Where's my? Da -da -da -da. This to center beast. Right there. Okay. Gonna, yeah. Like, not run, but hastily not take my time. <laughs> hastily not take my time. All right, so you like head over. There is. Uh... There we go. That you see some more of the floating spheres that were around. You also see two very large flowering plants. Very, very thick. Very heavy leaves. Kick. Seems like there's a. Uh, like there might. Well, let's see. Yeah, you're a bit far at the moment. It's like it looks like they're kind of sitting up on like mounds, maybe. Yeah, six to, Yeah, it's too far to tell where you are. And then there, are, there, are, there are definitely lights behind them, and there are lights that are right in front of you. Speaking of which, like right in front of you, very close. Very close. I'm gonna be twenty feet. I want to be twenty feet away from the plant here. Well, that sounds like a you problem. Well, I moved. I moved over there, so. Do you not want to be that far? Away? I I want to be twenty feet at minimum twenty feet. Okay. You prowl past them. I'll assume Rania follows. Sir, uh, I gotta follow. Can I jump on her back? I'm just gonna jump on her back. <laughs> okay. You walk I will off. roll over and like put my paws on your chest. I'm tiny. Exactly. Wow. But what's the problem? Wow. Look, lady, you're fucking walking through the forest. I don't want to step on any weird shit. All right, I'm not. Uh, mm, just let me ride on your back. My legs are tired. Wow. It's basically all you're gonna get out of her right now. All right. So, are you gonna try and resist this, or are you gonna let it happen? No, I'm not letting it fucking happen. Why not? All right. <laughs> we could move so much faster. You could run. I could ride. Everything. Everything works. Go ahead and both of you roll contested dexterity checks. Let's see who moves a little bit faster. Oh well. That's uh -huh. not gonna work. Nat twenty. So Rania goes for you, but uh, her footfalls are quite loud. And you're pretty sure you know what's about to happen. You just it's just instinct. And you dodge out of the way. As Ronnie and nearly completely face plants. On Kitty. Be a little shit. Into a little bundle of small little white capped mushrooms. You notice there's uh there's a few lights coming your way. Four, maybe five. Friends of yours? Like, kind of burying my teeth, looking at them. Like, not. Okay, take that as a no then. Um. Hello, friends! We come in peace. You can lead us to your masters, I guess. Look, lady, I'm not good at this shit! 
You watch as the pink moat that has been with you pulls back and elevates itself a little bit higher as these wo- as these wisps seem to enter your body. Or they're very least occupy your space. You're not, like, possessed or anything. That's uncomfortable. It is uncomfortable, actually. Because that's... That's eight points of damage to Chili. What? Fourteen points of damage to uh, Rania. As the as you feel this elect, the sort of lightningish, if you've ever if you've ever been struck by if your characters have ever been struck by lightning, uh, spark and burn in your bodies as the as these sprites or wisps or whatever they are pass right through you and come out behind you. Yeah, that's really uncomfortable. Jesus. And start, and uh, a few of them let out little pulses of light. Afterwards. Alright. What do you want? You watch now and... No. Okay. You watch now as more lights start to approach you and come around and you hear sort of a, a low groan. A grumble, maybe? Uh, uh, that doesn't from over sound by, good. From over by where the plants, where there's two large flowering plants are. You see two looks like very, very damaged looking humanoids are sort of staggering towards you. You have to roll for initiative again. But do you like it or not? Kids. Damn it. <laughs> okay, where is my token? Tiny, that's why. Is that a short joke? Oh wow, we both roll 18. <laughs> yeah, but I can't select my token, so I can't. Uh, well, you can, well, I will fix that in a moment. You, while well, you two decide what uh, what you want to do, or who wants who wants to go first. Either you care. Well, somebody has to. Go uh, so that's what I mean, I guess we just roll for it. I don't care, so not, if I know what I'm doing. It says you have I'm access to it. Cancel. Oh, I might, oh, sure I, might be, I might just be a dumbass. Oh, yeah, I'm just a dumbass. Alright, cool. Okay. So these are like corpses, They're correct? Definitely not alive, that's for damn sure. Well, okay. probably not alive, I should say. It's kind of hard to tell. Dark light and all that. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, the bushes have AC. The bushes rolled initiative too. They're about to. Yeah. There we go. Oops. Just kidding. Okay. Oh, no, hold on. Which one's ugly? All right, so top of the round, we have Rania. What do? Do 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 do. There you go. Good boy. With your with her quick reflexes and fast thinking, Rania decides to. Yeah. Oh, 
Yeah, yeah that's you. That's me. Oh shit. Uh huh. Oh. No. Just reading through. Uh, da, 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 da. Yep. Guess I will. How far are they? Thirty feet. Ronnie is first going to move here and throw a dart. Twenty-two. At what? At this gentleman. At his face. At his face. Well, he doesn't have a face, but he's still, you know, kind of hit him. You're f yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yes, you. Uh, you definitely hit with a twenty-two. Eight piercing damage. All right. You watch as the as this flowering bush sort of shakes and rustles a little bit, but it still doesn't move. It's not moving. It it does not, it has not moved. It does not move. Interesting. Did somebody say kiting? I think somebody said kiting. Oakley, what are you gonna do? Ow. Go pounce. Please. I'm gonna, that's gonna be on this. Yeah, that's this. So that'll be this one. This one. This one. Yeah. Um. So. And then, so yeah, I'm gonna do the pounce and claw. So I'll move. To Shit. there. Really? No, here. I'll move to here. So the claw. Oh, I'm not sure if this is gonna be right. 17. Did the 17 hit? <laughs> or actually. Hit, you're going for one of the zombie dudes? Okay. Yes. Okay. Um, yeah, yeah. Hits with the claw in the same turn. The target must succeed on a DC strength saving throw. Okay, so that'll hit. Okay. What's the what's the DC? Uh, twelve. Okay. For, yeah, it says on a DC twelve. Eleven. That's a fail. <laughs> so it is um it is knocked prone, and since it is prone, I can also make a bite attack. So, well, first there's the claw damage, um, or that's the piercing. So, All right. I'm sorry. That, that's so. the slashing. And then uh, I can, yeah, and then and I can do a bite attack. Oh gosh, I don't think a bite's gonna hit those. That's not gonna work. Yeah, that would be that would have been my bonus action. You leap into him and jump, and he, and he falls down, and you're on top of him, and you're about ready to take a bite out of him. But that. Didn't but you work. don't. <laughs> but a, but a but an unnatural jerking motion from the zombie itself. Almost has you tasting dirt. Yum. Alright, number next we have. This plant. This, you watch as one of these flowering plants starts to oh, now it burns. Starts now to it burns. shamble towards the panther. You need to. A good constitution saving throw. We lost Chile. Oh, I do. I like oh, this. Oh yeah, you're fine. It it, <laughs> it stinks, but you know you've smelled worse. This ain't this ain't this ain't nothing. <laughs> How does the zombie looking thing look after my? Claw? It, it looks pretty beat up. It, well, it already looked pretty beat up, but it looks worse. <laughs> Worse question mark. Uh -huh. Alright, so the plant's going to now plant's going to lash out at you with three of its jeez. Oh, okay. Does a fourteen hit? Or did like an eight? Fourteen well, yes. Ooh, right. Alright, so with one of them, it's you For seven bludgeoning damage, and you need to make another Constitution saving throw. 
Damn. Oh, no. That's a fail. That will... Another seven points of damage. Uh, poison damage as it slashes into you and you feel this almost like acidic caustic burn. Hold on. Okay, so that puts me there. So that will transform me back into my into Oakley. Okay. That will transform me back into Oakley and then the damage carry carries over to nine hit points. Okay. So, okay. Just so clear on what all that was. So now I'm back, yeah, to me. Uh, oh, I see. Yeah, okay. Was that it then? That's it for that one. Uh, this other, right. this, the other, this other plant shambles over in this direction. Can't really do anything else with it. With that. Come on! Thank you. By the gods. We have thing one, which is looking like shit. Uh, we'll make a. We'll take a swipe at you with a three. I ain't gonna work. No, take a swipe at me from here. No, the, the zombie that's right by you, that's right next to you, will. In front. And the In other front. one will too. And I got a three. It doesn't matter. They don't hit. All right, just let it go. <laughs> well, if this one was. Never mind. Okay. If he was prone, it can, you can still make attacks while you're prone. It would be a disadvantage, but it got a three. So, there's no <laughs> point in me rolling again. Yeah. If it gets a higher one, well, yeah, whatever. Yep. Yep. You, you watch as these wisps uh, sort of swirl around the plant. And... Seem to almost make, make like a almost almost pulse and change their lighting intensity. Uh, Rania, it's your turn. Mm hmm. Which one? The that one was looking beat up. The one that's next to. More the pink dot is looking beat up. Wait, so we're fighting four enemies? Oh, those look like background. Okay, that makes so much sense. I was like, damn, I only see two. Huh. Well, better not let her get flanked. Uh, move here and take a swipe at pink looking bitch. Uh, pink eye. With my unarmed strikes. Does a 13 hit? Oh, yeah, that'll hit. Uh, da, 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 da. You can so unarmed strike. Oh boy! When you use an attack action with an unarmed strike or monk weapon on your turn, you can make one on un one unarmed strength unarmed strike as a bonus action. So do I re-roll the attack the the attack roll or the damage roll? You can make one unarmed strike as a bonus action. Take the attack action. You can also make a one arm strike. Yeah, you get to roll again. It's not just bulk matter. It's a little sneaky there. Yes? Because an unarmed strike is an attack. It's just different than a melee attack. Because there's because it's unarmed. Okay. Oh, yeah, twenty will work. <laughs> since since the thirteen worked. You know. 13 bludgeoning damage. Oh, yeah. Okay. You, uh, you leap onto this still prone looking zombie man and pummel him until his face looks like pizza. And he just sort of shudders and just goes face first into the ground. He doesn't move. Do you want to do anything else? We let sign up. 
Hello. Kind of serious, or if I sue them, shall I? Thought out, come back. I heard something. I heard something from somebody just now. Uh, there it goes. Hello. Oh, finally. Heck. I, was getting, I was getting lonely. Yeah, me too. Anyway, <laughs> whose turn is it? Uh, I was oh, gonna. I, I just asked if Ronnie. I wanted to do anything else. Okay, so that guy. Did I kill the? Oh, yeah, yeah, he's dead. He's totally dead, babe. He's super duper dead. He's he's more dead than he's ever been, with thirteen bludgeoning damage. Yeah, he did not have a lot of HP left. Interesting. So did That's you? Not what I expected here? to happen. <laughs> kind of at a loss now. Um, right. Yeah. There's definitely not anything else going on. Yeah, uh, I can't really do anything. So <laughs> that'll be the end of my turn. Um. Mm -hmm. On my turn. On my yeah, turn. no, I don't even have a bonus action anymore. So yeah, no, that's it. Oakley, <clears throat> make it happen. Make it rain. I will. Do I have but to? I'm gonna, but I'm gonna use a fire spear. Oh jeez, it didn't even load it. Really? Uh, uh oh. It's, what the fuck? It's 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 what? Can you guys hear me? I can hear. Chili. I can hear you. Oh, I can hear okay. Chili. Okay. Uh, well. I don't know why I did that. Are you chilly? I am not. But I'm ch What? Say Hey! I'm chilly. Hey. <laughs> I am the chilly now. No. Yes. Why yes. It, why won't it let me? It's literally blanking. <laughs> why is it blank? I don't understand. You don't have to understand. Ah. You just have to do. Oh my god. Um... Why not there, Jesus. Okay. Um, hey, so don't talk bad about Jesus. Bad. Didn't do shit to you. <laughs> he just okay, said Jesus. So... <laughs> she didn't say good or bad. Jesus. Wait, Jesus. So the first. Jesus. So. Yeah, flaming sphere. I'm gonna make a little 
fire sphere. Uh -huh. And it's and it's gonna go right here. And oh, suck right. someone's toes. There's nothing there, Chili. I know. Okay. Because but it affects anybody within five feet of it. So that guy and this guy. Okay. And then uh, they must make a dexterity saving throw. For half of six. Okay. Well, I guess, yeah. I'm sure it's supposed to be five, half of five. Make a dexterity. I'm not going to quibble over a point. Okay, so. <laughs> so. Alright, so Buford takes the full force of the damage there. Did you name him Buford? <laughs> Do we need to adopt this NPC? No, no, no. You have, and you've adopted enough NPCs. We have get... not adopted a single NPC. <laughs> well, it's, it's, that's just because plain. You just kind of, it. you just kind of phased them out and didn't, and never mentioned them ever again. The planes kept forgetting. He was like, he's like a Labrador, just going from one toy to the next every five seconds. He this is true. Like a, he wanted to have like a bunch of sprites following him around. And then, yep. he just, and then he forgot. And then he was like, oh, we need Gavin. Oh my god, I need him. And then he forgot about yep. him. Go. And I was like, okay, I'm not going to remind him at all. Because it's not in my best interest. So. Yep. Anyways. I know. I noticed it, and I was like, well, I'm not going to be a dick. It's, it's a lot of work. <laughs> it's like, you don't understand. So, this, this little sphere thing that yes. I made did. Yeah. <laughs> okay. the, the, not a sphere at all. What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, you just hell. You have to just hold down shift when you make it. That's all it is. Yeah, any, oh God. Okay. Oh, that's not. You, know, you don't know what you're doing. <laughs> no, I, I mean, don't. I mean, alt. I'm sorry. You have to hold down alt to make it. Anyway, so which one did it end up attacking? It attacked both because it was within five feet, right? Yes, but which one actually? Okay, so they both took damage. Yes. The, okay. The, First one was for the flowering plant, the second one was for Buford. So Buford, okay. Or Buford. I will, and then as He turned his buddy into like a smear. I don't even want to hear it. Okay. Hey man, he, he didn't have a name. <laughs> that doesn't make it right. It does. If they don't have names, they're killable. Oh. Okay, so I'm also going to use my bonus action to throw this control, throw the spear at this plant. So that plant now has to make a saving throw. Another saving throw. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so that's another six points to, the, yeah. to a different... And if, I'm, and, if, and if I'm reading this, its duration is one minute, so... Does that... That means that's... concentration, right? Yes. Okay. So, will my sphere stick around then, or is well, that the end Well, obviously, that? that's how concentration works, but... Yes. Yes, it is. Being... What's the point of it being concentration if it doesn't stick around? That's what I'm asking. Why? But why? Why are you asking that question? I don't know how magic works! It doesn't works. make sense for it to be anything other than what it is. Anyways, so that's your turn. Alright, so. Uh, we got Fern and Gully. Alright, so Fern's gonna go first. <clears throat> Fern's going to <clears throat> move over to where. Uh, whatever, nameless zombie number one <laughs> was. And you're going to. And you watch as. Uh, it's pretty much. It's doing a combination of floating and walking on vines. You watch as some of these vines pick up the corpse and tuck it underneath into the mound of dirt and flower and plant growth. Out of curiosity, is it that is. an opportunity of attack? Is that an opportunity of attack since it, it moved? Not, no, it, it has not left your uh, reach. It just it just circled around. No. So no, if if it moves away like that, yes. Okay. Oh, so that's its action. And this one doesn't like being near the near fire, and it's gonna move up and take three attacks against what's her face. 
front of you. As it lashes out with three tentacles, all of which miss. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> That's fun. Ronnie has had bad experiences with tentacles. Well, I mean, Come now, on, now, man. now she's had a good experience. I mean, fucking miss her with three single digit rolls. How much right. damage do I take? None, because they're None. all single digits. They all oh wow! Hit. Yeah, thanks. Nice. That sounds. And that's also like it nice. sucks. You know what? It has advantage. Let me just roll again. <laughs> oh, look at that twenty. <laughs> all You're right. gonna like cool. pop in my face, aren't you? <laughs> be funny. All right, Ronnie, it's your turn again. Please don't pop in my face. Okay. Oh Jesus Christ, that was so loud. I'm so glad it didn't pop in my face. Yeah. Holy shit, it dented my wall. <laughs> oh, this beer smells extra fermented. Uh. All right, so it's my turn. Yes. Barely. Barely. Shit. Well, Buford, I'm sorry, <gasps> but we can't adopt you, so you're gonna have to explode. <laughs> explode. Explode. Does that hit? Oh yeah. Okay. Does unarmed strike work with flurry of blows? No, right? No, it's one or the other. Ah, oh, sad. Alright, fuck it. I'll burn a key point. <laughs> okay. Two unarmed strikes is a bonus action. Okay. Oh, uh, Jesus. Yep. <laughs> nice. Two. So that is 23 points of damage. Is he alive? No, he is not. Yeah, definitely none. You just We're jump gonna on miss the you, next... Buford. No, you're not. <laughs> well, then you shouldn't have killed him, asshole. You. Hey, man. <laughs> Survival of the fittest. Uh, oh. He clearly wasn't very fit. He, he has a seven died initiative. once. You're gonna kill him again, asshole. Yeah. You're so unkind. Put him back to rest. You're not a good Canadian at all. Oh. Well, <laughs> sometimes sacrifices have to be made. Wow. So, well, that's willing. That's what I'm willing to make. All right. Yep. So you uh, you jump on zombie number two and pummel him into uh, grease stain. Buford. On the floor. You jump onto Buford and pummel him into a smear on the floor, kind of like that. Was kind of like his friend, his ex lover. All right. Oakley, or do you want to move, or are you done? I'm not gonna move. Not uh... you. Sign on. Do you want to move, or are you done? Uh, I'm done. Okay, Oakley, it's your turn. The flaming spear. Oh Jesus. Um, so my little spear, my spear thing. I'm gonna move it to here. Um, so that's it. It's in between my the two plants here. Yep. So, go ahead and do the, the dex. Yeah, they're not very dexterous. Yeah, they're not very dexterous at all. <laughs> yeah, they both hit. Because it's against now, my... Now, 14 against... says it's an 11. No, I don't think so, because I thought it was against my spell saves. Right, My spell right. save... My spell save DC is 15. I don't know oh, why it says 11, okay. though. I don't know why that's saying that. Alright, fine. So, they both take 5 damage. Yeah. yeah, with that, I think that'll be the end of. Because uh, I don't think I'll be able to move it again. Would, be, would I be able to move it again since that was no. just the attack? You moved it once. You moved it over there. Right, because. You want to move it once, attack, and then move it again. Well, I don't, I don't, I don't think that's how that works. What does the spell say? Five foot diameter sphere, your fire appears okay. in an unoccupied space of choice within range and lasts for the duration. Any creature 
and turn within five feet must take it, must make a dex saving throw. Um, creature takes two d six or or half on bonus action. You can move the spear up to up to thirty feet. Okay, so you use your bonus action to move the spear. Okay. Um, you can dark. Yeah. Okay. And. With that being said, as my. Well, I, I can't use that. That's that's a bonus action, isn't it? Shit. Because I can't use two bonus actions to replace an action, right? <laughs> no. Um. Well, I have my action. I have my regular action, so I will use the. Um, I'll use this. Oh no, that doesn't hit anybody. It doesn't, doesn't matter. No, it does not. All right, so that's no. it for you then. Unless you want to move. Yeah. No. Okay. All right, so fern. fern. Back over here. Fern, don't does, like fern doesn't like fire. Let's go and take some strikes at uh, wherever you are. Oh, Oi. really? Really? God. <laughs> She's yeah, trying to, you know, roll. make it even by not taking off some of the modifiers. Hit. I guess that was the wrong thing to do. Hmm. <laughs> Oh, no. Well, it's too late it's now. Late. No, it's not. What are you talking about? Isn't right, it? So 19. It's never too late when you're in the DM. 19. I could have Poison Ivy come out of fucking nowhere and just be like, Rise, my friends! I'll be them, Zyra. I'll get them all empowered. 19 will hit. Well. Oh, cool, but it's not at you, so it's no. Oh, it isn't? No. Which plant? Oh, it's the other plant? Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Never mind. <laughs> I thought it was the one next to me. Okay. Uh, I understand. Does something hit? Something hit yeah, 19 will hit. Ooh. 17 damage? Uh, uh, uh that was supposed to be 2d6, so take away the 5. Or take away the 6, <laughs> yeah. whatever. I'm not going to quibble over a point. Just drop one of them. Uh, uh, okay. Well, we gotta kill these plants quickly. <laughs> well, if you notice, fire seems to be working. Speaking, speaking <laughs> of killing plants quickly, it's now Rania's turn. What up, girl? Uh, I'm gonna take a swing at Mr. Tentacle Monster here. Because I don't like me no tentacle monsters. Leave a bad taste in your mouth, do they? Oh no. That's a miss. With a plus eight. Holy crap. Oh my. Two. <laughs> you, yeah. Uh, you make us. You treat. For some reason, you just instinctually think it's time to sweep the legs. But. <laughs> they don't have doing, no legs. It's, it's kind of walking with like a couple of vines, but it's mostly hovering or some magical method. And you just go and you like brush all the vines with your staff, or it's not an arm strike, whatever, with your leg. <clears throat> it's, yeah, it doesn't, it's just kind of like playfully bats at him. Well, shit. Well, shit. All right, Oakley. Do you? Oh uh, wait, no, I'm I'm oh, not okay. done. Okay. Not done. Okay. okay. Go back to uh, me. I am going to disengage. Ooh. Okay. And let's see how fast can I move. Really super fucking fast. I remember correctly. Uh, we're probably gonna head like all the way over here. Twenty five. Twenty five. Twenty five. Twenty five. Twenty five. Twenty-five. Alrighty. Alright, now it's Oakley's turn. Use... Scimitar? 18 Scimitar is successful. Up. That'll work. Yes, ma'am. Right. Six slashing. 
Oh, I was saying the one that's right. Oh, oh what? I click on the wrong. Okay. Okay. Click on six one. Okay. Yes, got it. Got it. Six. You uh, lean forward, take a slash out of this stinking plant. You have mixed feelings about it, I would imagine, <clears throat> being a druid. And as my bonus action, yes. I will use hit, hit, hidden self. Hide self? It's, it's the sky self, I thought. What is? Hidden self. That's a fur, fur rogue feature. Oh, man, the other one would be too invisible. Okay. Hidden self. Okay. You turn invisible. So there is. Nothing for them to attack. You're all the way over there. There's no way they're gonna make it. But they're still gonna try. You can't see. <laughs> they uh, they slowly move over, move over towards you, but uh, they're they're not nearly as fast as the monk. So it's now your turn. <laughs> yes. Yes, it is. <laughs> uh, uh. tag, bitches. Bitches? <laughs> Why are we talking about bitches? I don't want to do no bitches. Because I said so. Bitches love cake, man. I ain't got no cake. Sorry. I ain't got I'm gonna throw a dart at Mr. Tentacle Monster here. Oh yeah, that'll hit. Oh yeah. <laughs> Seven piercing damage. Seven entire points of piercing damage directed. Okay. Alright, you watch, you throw your dart, you watch as it disappears into the leafy plantiness of your target. You hear yep. kind of you hear kind of like a squawk and it shivers a little bit. I feel like you uh, successful. Do you want to move or anything else? Um, yeah, we're gonna keep kiting. Which way am I gonna go though? That's a good question. Uh, shit. That away. No, that away. Wait, am I still in range? Yes. Not that one, but this one. Okay. That's my turn. Okay. It is now Oakley's turn. Oakley. I'm going to move, um, move forward so I can make an attempt at another uh, some... Um, let me do mace. I'm gonna try mace here. Twelve. That was a twelve hit. Yeah, I'm working on it, chill it. Yes, it does. Oh, sorry. <laughs> well, I couldn't tell. I didn't write down. I know, I know. I didn't write down the frickin' AC. So I have to check my so. stat block. Yes, the twelve hits. Yes, six. <laughs> Six, Six bludgeoning. bludgeoning damage. Okay. And then I will move my fire sphere um, straight forward as well, because I can move up to 30 feet and make uh -huh. a dex saving throw. That's a well, fail! That's a fail. Damage. So, uh, fuck. <laughs> Where'd it go? Um, silly chili. Silly chili. Stop picking on me. Do, 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 do. Silly chili. Stop picking on me. Do, 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 do. Oh, it's, two D, it's 2D6. Okay. Silly chili. Stop picking on me. Do, do, do. Silly chili. Another six damage of fire. Oh, yeah. Only 99 hit points left. God, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. No. We're gonna be here until 2 30 in the morning. Okay. You move your Oh yeah. Through. Oh no. That definitely fermented over the week. You, Whew. you are 
worrisome sometimes. You know what I mean? Oh my god. Uh, I worry myself sometimes, yes. Oh. Okay, right, cool, great. Alright, so it is now Fern's turn. Fern's gonna move over here. Cool. <laughs> don't, it really don't like fire. <laughs> well, a shocker, right? And it's a plant. <laughs> it's definitely a plant. With nobody's tentacles, gonna, though. Nobody's gonna argue that. 16. Sixteen. Wait, sixteen will hit. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's what I like to hear. So we'll do, uh, five whole points of damage. Oh, that's cute. As it smacks at you with its tentacles, and it. it it hurts, but it's not as bad as you uh, were expecting. Uh, Florence is going to go ahead and move back over here. You watch as the zombie that Rania pummeled into a stain it gets folded up into this slightly floating plant. Oh, Rania, it is your turn. My turn. Tis. Is. No. That's not good. Uh. Well, you know me and my darts. Oh, wait, that's 40 feet. Fuck. Rania's gonna move up. Her. And that's 30 feet. And then throw a fucking dart. Oh, I'm retarded. Oh, 15 God. to hit. Sorry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> do, do More it. damage. Do it, do it. <sighs> Alright, all right. you watch as... Which is the plant starts to sort of list, even though it's not uh, it's not hovering too far to begin with. Uh, not hovering too far above the ground on it to begin with. Alright, are you done? Uh, uh, yeah, that'll be my turn. Okay, Oakley. Do your thing. Spike growth. Oh, for fuck's sakes! Ugh, why is it not fucking? It's spike growth. Um, why is this not being fucking on me? Um, maybe if it's gonna show up in my main thing here. No, fuck no, of course not. Um, spike growth. There's no info card, chillers. I, I know. This is kind of annoying. I don't You're know why it's doing. Teasing me with what I think is going to be competence, and it's not. Fucking. <gasps> oh. Really? Why is it. Fuck's sake. Well, I'll just. Let me find it here. It might bring it up. Nature. Industrial strength chip. What? <laughs> Fully rigged chip. Commercial grade chip. <laughs> I'll start this way. 
see if this works. I'm hot and not at all. Shit. Um, the ground in the 20 foot radius Ooh. at a point sparks and thorns. It becomes okay. difficult terrain. Cool. So, go ahead, do, pick, out, pick out where you want to put it. Uh, you click and hold alt and it'll make the circle. Easier. Well, we're gonna get this. We're gonna work on this together until you get it. Nope, that's not jelly. That's. Not... Okay. Right, I'll just do it. It's fine. I'll just do it myself. I should never have relied on you for this. This is pale, nasty ass green juice system. All right, where do you want it? Just show me where. You... Show me where you want it. Mm. Uh, right where the screen is? Yes, Daddy. Uh, no, I'm trying to. Oh, I know what I'm doing. Uh, Do you? Draw a shape. How do I draw this? A different shape. Draw a rectangle, hold all for. Oh! I get it. <laughs> right, because that's what I told you to do. I, I get it now. Oh, I'm so glad. Is that about 20? Is that 20 feet? I don't yeah. see anything. Nothing's coming up. Uh, one, two, three, five. It should be, it's four. Whoa! What makes you think that's 20 feet? It's 5, 10, 15, 20. <laughs> the full circles is what I was trying to do. Uh, right, but it's in the. Okay. Yeah, okay. I'm trying to make it smaller. Uh, you can't. You have to delete it and start it over. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I know. <laughs> Whatever, it's fine. You got them both. It doesn't really matter because they're both kind of floating, so I wouldn't really worry about it. They're both kind of floating, but they move. I have both right. But is it difficult to? It's difficult terrain. If you hover over the terrain, it's not. Who cares? That's like saying an, it's like saying an eagle would be affected by this difficult terrain. No, but nah. The transformation of the ground is camouflaged to look natural. Ooh. They don't. All right, so all right, so you cast that. Uh, when a creature moves into it or within. The all right, so two d four. It just says if they move, not if they start their turn. Okay. Uh, you want to do anything else? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna move the fire spear again. <laughs> It's gonna go yeah. So okay. two D what did I say? It was two D four? Shit, two D six. I think it was two D six. I think it's two D seven. So one will hit. No, they both hit. Well, one only one should hit because my spell my spell save is fifteen, right? Right, but it but it still takes half damage. So you still hit. Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. That is my that's my turn. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Let's front and over here. Smickety smack. Oh, Merciful Minerva, I can't do anything. Oh my god! Shut up! You're just having a hell of a time. I don't even why. I don't even want to play. Why am I even playing this game? I hate this game. <laughs> what? Whatever. You know what? They're both defeated. There. You guys can move on. It's fine. <laughs> What's the point? Whatever. Oh Who my cares? god. Whatever. Let's just do something else. You, know, oh, you guys want to play League? It's a much better game than I don't hate at all. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Okay, so if they're dead, um, I'll just can we establish that we're taking a long rest then? You're well, going to take a long rest in this first? Tired. Okay. We're gonna yeah. Hit. You can yeah. Do that. Sure. I won't stop okay. you. <laughs> That's so, that sound good. So, so not reset everything, <laughs> you know, just Dana? Dana? 
Isaac. Bye. Me. Hi, Sana. Hello. We were just talking about you. Hello. What chili Please? wants to take a long rest? Oh, um. Are, we're just gonna sleep in the forest? Mm -mm. Yeah. She seems to be okay with it. I'll <laughs> take first watch. You know, She'll take wait. first watch, even. See? <laughs> yes. And then here, even to be even more convincing. Wow. Even to be even more, even more convincing. Oh, oh, now you fucking load? Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna make a little, um, small campfire. I'm gonna make a small Aww. campfire. <sighs> Right. Well, I... Mm -hmm. I guess if the forest person thing, whatever the fuck you are, is fine with it, then whatever. <laughs> and Ronnie will just immediately go to sleep, like doesn't even lie down or anything, just like falls over and goes to sleep. It, it, it's 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 a talent, actually. Clearly, right. very tired to be clear. Like, narcoleptic. Yeah. Totally. Alright. <laughs> so, you can. So, you can make a perception check. Not me, I assume. Well, you know, not you, Shooty. You're unconscious. Twenty-five. <laughs> you... You still notice the occasional flyby of the pink sphere that has been with you since the beginning. And you also notice quite a few shifting lights over, over the course of your shift that are out there in the in the fungal forest, some of which seem to blend in with the bioluminescent mushrooms and other mosses and mold and all that. Some of which actually come a little a little close, but through some clever ingenuity and you know, a little bit of luck, we managed to keep them from getting too close to the sleeping compatriot that you have found yourself stranded here with. Right. This is uh, this is probably a good spot to stop, actually. That's why I was kind of like, doing, right. kind of looking at the time and stuff and seeing yeah. your frustration, you were just like, fuck <laughs> it! <laughs> I'll get over it, I always do. You rolled all single digits. Yes, thank you, Chili. I was there. <laughs> oh, just in case. In case you, you need to write did, that down. Did, did you did you want to roll single digits next time? Because I can make that happen. I'm good. Or, oh, oh, okay. oh. oh, she said all sweetness and light. Huh? Where'd, I'm, I'm hey, where'd, my, where'd my person go? Oh, my you're person's dead. gone. You're dead. You're dead. <laughs> my person's gone. You're just dead. You're, you're just, <laughs> I, I have decreed it. Thou art finished. <laughs> Thou art complete. Okay, Don't need uh, anything else there at all. Right, love? Alright. <laughs> Alright. Uh, that so was I'm two and a half hours. Y'all wanna play some?